matching. We kind of are. Yes. Hi, Mark. Matching. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. They're very excited because they didn't know you were here. This is a surprise. So. They're happy to see you. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing? Good. Congrats on everything. A lovely, lovely speech on the Golden Globes. Oh, thank you very way. much. Yeah. That was a, was a fun night. Yeah. Um, I, I, I heard that you do the same thing every year. Is this for Christmas and New Year's? You go to the same island? Yes. Yeah. Every year. You Barbados. don't want to try a new place? I would be willing to try. My wife, I think, is now insisting this year that we're going to go to a new place. But my kids all have friends there. It's very safe. They kind of Oh, because other it. families go there from yeah, there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's kind of the same people every year. So they go, like, you know, kids will go out at 7 in the morning. They'll come back at 7, 8 o'clock at night. And you don't have to worry. We get a little time to ourselves, so it's nice. Oh, that is nice. Yeah. Um, and uh, you, I saw your daughter is into horses. I saw a picture yes. of her. She's 10? She turned 10, yes. Okay. We had a little party for her in Barbados so she could have it with her friends, but then we had a real party last week at home. Yeah. Now, expensive, expensive, uh, it's an expensive, expensive hobby. hobby. Yes. Yeah. Hobby. It's a I very, it's how? It's more like a career for her, but. Do you think it is going to be a career? Is she jumping? Oh, she's in. She's jumping. Yeah, she's in. But she what got What is she jumping? What height? Uh, hope you know what I mean. Right now, it's like that. Yeah. But you know, she's got the dog on a leash, making the dog jump. She's like everything revolves around horses. Right. That's Daisy May, her horse. But uh, she wanted to go to the tax store for her birthday, and she had gotten a gift a gift certificate for a friend, and then we said we'd match it. And I thought, okay, this is good. She could kind of add up what things cost and, you know, learn some financial responsibility. Her and my wife were just throwing everything in the carts. It was like, you know, you get everything you can grab for an hour for free. I mean, mm -hmm. they thought it was one of those deals. So she went way over the budget. But um, she loves it. And it's one of those things where I think it's a great distraction from boys and all that stuff. She's like, she's shoveling. She takes care of the horse. The horse lives better than me, by the way. Yeah, no. He it, gets all the love. If I get a hug or a kiss every once in a while, I'm lucky. Meanwhile, you know, she's like. And is that her horse? Yes, she owns the horse. Yeah, you should get, for our nieces, we gave them jumps in the yard so they can actually run and jump and do the jumps like horses do. Yeah. Do you have that for them? She's turned the whole playroom. The boys aren't even allowed in there anymore. She's made jumps out of boxes, broomsticks, whatever she can use. You Hockey net got, the soccer net got destroyed turned into uh, jumping boards. You have money. Buy the jumps that I'm talking about. Um, I'm worried about the lawn. <laughs> I never had a lawn. I never had a lawn, and literally. Yeah, and so now you do? Yeah, so I want to protect the lawn. <laughs> I want to protect the lawn. You got a dog. The dog's going to destroy that lawn. No, he's this big. It's like, that was it, one of the things when I saw the guy who had the Pomeranian. I was like, oh, how big does that dog get? And he said, well, this is full grown. And I said, <gasps> And Look I said, that. how big is the poop? He said, it's like a t little Tootsie Roll. I said, I, I can manage that. <laughs> so I, was, I agreed to then get the dog. Now, meanwhile, we're going to uh, training because the dog thinks he's a Rottweiler. He's tried to attack me and everybody else. They're funny dogs. Is that a purebred Pomeranian? Yes. They're really funny dogs. They have a great personality. They are. My kids are now, their whole mission is to make this dog famous. Like, they've created an Instagram account. Champ Iranian, by the way, if anybody. What? Wants to check them out. They get me doing all these posts and everything, but what's, they absolutely. What's the name love of the dog? Champ. Champ. Yes. It's a cute dog. It is a very yeah. cute dog. And uh, the crazy story because I was not going to get a dog. We weren't good with pets. Uh, and then I finally decided because it was a very manageable dog, I thought, um, that we would get that dog. And I told my kids I was going to surprise them. Something very important or someone very important was coming to the house. I told my one son because he was leaving for track, he left. I told the other kids somebody important's coming. Meanwhile, I'm in a meeting with my wife. She barges in the meeting and goes, I need to talk to you right now. Drags me outside and goes, why is Kim Kardashian and Kanye West coming here at dinner time? I said, what are you talking about? She said, Brendan and Grace literally said, oh, if it's somebody important, it's got to be them. <laughs> so I'm like, it's not them. It's not them. I, I, got a, I got a dog. And then she got upset because I didn't include her in the selecting of the dog and everything else. I said, no, I think you'll like the dog. She said, what kind of dog? I said, it's Pomeranian. She goes, I hate those little furry dog. She was so upset. So I said, okay, well, tell the kids they can't have the dog when it comes in five yeah. minutes. <laughs> so she's sitting there waiting by the door. I mean, and I knew I was in trouble. And the woman comes in, lays down the crate. The dog, she opens the gate. Champ walks out, and my wife dives on the ground. Says, oh, my God, it's the most beautiful dog I've ever <laughs> yeah. seen. Starts choking the dog. I'm like, won't let the kids see the dog or hold the dog. I'll have to send you those pictures. But thankfully, she now, everybody's in love with the yeah. dog. But the dog runs the house. You can't walk around without it barking, like in the yeah. morning or at night. Yeah. So we're now all having to go to training ourselves yeah. to deal with the dog. Yeah. 
You can't send them away because then you need to learn how to. I know. Yeah. Well, yeah. You know what? But the, the smiles on their faces were absolutely precious. They're, they're great little dogs. That's Best a great addition. All right. We have to take a break. More with Mark after this.